So, we are here with Ninja Division, with John and Kitty. So, how is PAX East going? It's amazing. Amazing. Great. Wonderful. Perfect. All right, so what's, what's new with Ninja Division? Well, so we have a big swanky booth and a lot of space to play and hang out. We have Forgotten King being delivered like in literally a week from China. Okay. It's going to show up on American Shores. So we actually taken the opportunity to let people play, try out the new game, try out the cooperative mode, kind of get into it. We're taking a few pre-orders here and there so we get some people to, you know, who missed their chance at the Kickstarter to get some copies of their own. Yeah. You know, as well as showing off all the swanky models and stuff. So Forgotten King's a focus for sure. Okay. Um, and then, of course, all of our other card games are showing off Karate Fight, and Tentacle Panto, and Don't Don't forget Fel Relic Knights. I haven't gotten a Relic Knights yet. Um, Dead Fellas, if you haven't seen that, we've, we've, we've taken over the printing of Dead Fellas, which is a great card game from uh, Jesper Mifers and uh, um, uh, Ernest... Uh, my brain hurts right it's, now. That's a key. You've got a lot of stuff going on. Um, and, uh, and and Brian Stoney, they, they made a great card game a few years back and picked up. And uh, yeah, you get to play a zombie mobster who's taking out, uh, taking out your opponent's books. So it's kind of fun. Okay. And uh, and yeah, and we're doing demos of Relic Knights here too. So that's what picking up some of course, having a great time. And, yeah, having a, having a great show with that. That's excellent. Okay, so what, you know, you're finishing up Forgotten, or Forgotten Kings, right? What's, what's the next for Super Dungeon Explorer? Well, Super Dungeon Explorer with Forgotten King is delivering like a year's worth of releases. So there's like true. war bands and characters and all kinds of stuff. But we've immediately pushed into development for what we talked about in some of our updates online, which is a product called Super Dungeon um, uh, Legends. Okay. And Legends is going to be kind of our little kickoff platform that we're using our second edition game to build out a game where you can like gain experience and play campaigns and have a much richer Super Dungeon uh, uh, a game that kind of goes week to week as opposed to just kind of a sit down and run through and play. Yeah. But uh, using using the Forgotten King as its baseline, we put so much stuff in that box set, we've really built it out to be a cool toolkit for building out nice little expansions like Legends as well as a couple other things we have in our play building for that too. Sure. So Super Dungeon is going to be a nice wild property we've been doing some things over the years. Excellent. Okay. And so the new Ninja All Stars. Yes, this is released recently, right? Not at all yet, actually. Not at so all. Okay, we, so uh, okay. end of the month, end of the month, we are going to launch our Kickstarter and tell the whole world about uh, okay. Ninja All Stars. But it's going to be uh, our, our, our third mainline property that we've developed in house. First time we developed something as Ninja Division, not just Soda Pop Miniatures. Right. So yeah. bringing in some of our other guys, um, a lot of a lot of game design went into this, and we wanted to build a different style of game than the other stuff we already have. So we like the chibi aesthetic. It's fun. We get to kind of play with that world because it's something that we're really, really good at. Um, but also, we wanted to build a game that really carried players from game to game to game to give them a reason to come back and play week over week. Sure. And in this game, we build a whole little, tiny little uh, clan of uh, ninja after some of our different varied clans that come in the game. And then in that, you guys get to gain experience and they get to learn cool skills and abilities. And so you take them from game to game, building more power as you go. And it's really fun to have that progressive gameplay sort of integrated into uh, in a sort of the larger scope of play. It's very competitive. It's a lot of fun. Yeah. As you said, Kickstarter at the end of the month? Kickstarter starts at the end of the month, yeah. Excellent, okay. And so, anything else going on with Ninja Division? That's a lot of stuff. Aside from all of that, yeah. um, we have a couple secret projects in the works, um, okay. and we'll be happy to share more about them, but not right now. Sure, sounds good. And so, Kitty, tell us about yourself. What's... Um, I have been cosplaying for, what, nine, six years? About that. Six years, uh, okay. solely with the Zoda Pop Miniatures guys, with friends of John, and I am representing the Relic Knights game. I'm Moffat. Okay. 